ZX Gaming, and we're starting with episode 3 of Don't Starve. Uh, exactly where we left off on the last one. Have no real clue what the plans are going to be or what we're going to do. I am hurt because of the frogs. Um, yeah, lovely, right? The last thing on earth you would think would hurt you in a game like this is a frog. Uh, let's go ahead and put the fishing rod up because I'm not going to fight them to try to fish. Go put that up. Charcoal and ashes we had for a reason. What was it? it was for that. Make that. I need that right now. Where is it? Didn't do too bad to help us out. And yes, I know it's almost night. That's why we're not going anywhere. We are definitely going to be going on another rock run while we speak of that. Let's see. We're going to head out that way to get more rocks. Uh, we definitely need more rocks. I don't know how I'm burning through them so quickly, but I am. Uh, a drying rack would be another thing that would be nice to have. An uh, ice box would be nice as well. I haven't even found gear, so that's not going to happen anytime soon. Let's craft up some rope. We can do that. Oh, no, that's refined. Alright, so now we can build a drying rack so we can actually make the monster meat edible, but we're gonna let that turn to rot. We still gotta figure out how to fertilize all this too. Uh, food, drying rack. Uh, can't really tell when it's green and when it's not. Alrighty, so we have a drying rack now. We're still gonna let that monster meat rot. Um, I guess we're gonna throw. I don't know why we're wasting time putting it in here, because I don't think it does much more for you. Uh, we're also going to be keeping an eye out for more food while we're running around. Uh, store the ashes. Flint stays on us. Pine cones can store. Sticks can stay. Logs can stay. Uh, and I, oh! Cook the frog legs. We're not going to cook them in the crock pot. We're just going to go ahead and eat them. Frog about kicked my butt. To get those frog legs, we're definitely going to eat them by themselves. Alright, we're okay food wise and everything else. Now we're going to go ahead and run off. Uh, we're going to head all the way down around this coast and back over where the rocks were. We've got to get more rocks. We've got to get more grass. Uh, definitely need more twigs. We'll see what we can do to keep establishing this base. I wish I could go around the other way, uh, but I don't think there is any connecting points up there. Uh, and we're not quite to the point of self-sufficiency, so we got a little ways to go. Wait, I've got a shovel, don't I? No, I don't. Let's make one, because I think that's a mandrake, and I think I can eat him. Let's equip that. A blue mushroom. I don't remember what that does. I know I can throw both pretty much anything in the crock pot and eat it, so it'll be getting thrown in the crock pot. Uh, I'm not messing with that. Oh, we could start trapping rabbits for food too, I didn't think about that. So we do have some of those around home too, and traps aren't that hard to make. Oh hush, I can't catch you, I already know this, I'm not gonna try. Surprisingly, well, not maybe not surprisingly, everything we've been making for home has been using rocks. That's kind of why this whole venture is beginning. I can't believe we've used as many as we have, actually. I thought we had an almost unlimited supply. Apparently, that was incorrect. I don't want to spend too much time doing this, but at the same point, I don't like to pass it and leave it either. We've got plenty of seeds at home for now. Um, food is going to start becoming an issue, and I don't know if I want to go more the farming route and hope that that makes it through the winter. Oh yeah, I've already got all the rocks I broke. Totally forgot about all these. But we will have plenty of rocks, we just had to come back out and get them. And then we don't even have to spend the time to break rocks. So that's a good thing. And then we're going to have to figure out something for more food. I don't know where exactly I want to head to try and find more. Could spend the night out tonight. I really don't want to, but I could. Could grab more gold. I'm not sure what all we're going to need it for at this point. So right now we're going to pass 
house on that and maybe see what's up here. Maybe there's some more food areas up here. I don't know if we've been here or not. You guys may remember. I'm not that bright. Don't think that far ahead. Come on, there's gonna be something up here to eat. I just need more stuff to bring home to put in the crock pot. Oh, I need twigs too. Shoot. Let's get the shovel back out. Let's bring some of these berry bushes home so we don't have to keep going looking for them. I guess I could bring the whole plant and the twigs home too. That would make more sense than hunting them down, even though we're having an issue finding enough rot to fertilize stuff. Better to have them at home than have to come all the way up here, though. More blue mushrooms, or are those green? Those are green. I don't know the difference between the blue and the green, actually. I don't think I've ever found the blue ones before. Probably gonna run into one of the big one-eyed bird thingies here soon. Normally that's what's up in this area. Doing okay on sanity still. We may camp out up here tonight. Probably not the most brilliant idea I've ever had, but we may. I don't think we're going to have time to get all the way back home, and there's not really enough resources down that way to survive on. We've already kind of scavenged most of them. Ooh, what'd you have? Ooh, you had a dart. We'll take your dart. We'll use that. You don't exactly need it anymore. It didn't help you any. And more twigs. Yes, please. And I think we're finding the edge of the map now. Again. Apparently that's going to be the whole story of this entire playthrough, is the edge of the map is here. You have to walk all the way back to where you just came from to get anywhere. Eat the stale carrots, just because there's no point in keeping them. I mean, I could have got a little more out of them by making them in the crock pot, but... I'm not real worried about that at this point. If I get enough rocks while we're out running around, and I know I'm not mining them at this point, if I get enough... At least we won't have to worry about making more farms and stuff, because I think we have enough of the beefalo poo, and if not, that's close enough to home. Uh, but either we're going to have to start using that to fertilize everything, which is going to be very expensive, or we're going to have to start letting something rot somewhere along the lines. We'll get enough berries to make at least the fistful of jam once we do get home, so even if we don't find anything else to actually eat tonight, we'll be fine. Plus, the mushrooms can go in the crock pot. 99% sure they're edible once they've been in the crock pot. I may find out the other way around and I kill myself. I'm not sure. But we'll find out together. Uh, I did not bring any boards with me, which might make fire a little complicated tonight. I mean, we can definitely do logs. We're just going to have to find some more trees to cut down before we can. Here we go. Let's do these before it comes too late. Because we are running out of daylight, and we will have to have a fire to keep from going insane. And we're going to break this axe. Luckily, we did grab a bunch of twigs while we were out, so we'll be able to make another one. We still have the torch, too. We could light the trees on fire. There's not going to last very long, but it's a possibility. And I'll probably put the fire right in the middle where we're cutting down all these trees here in a minute, and then we'll go dig up the stumps at night. It looks like it's going to be a rather short night. And then when we get home, we'll plant some more trees, plant some bushes, since we finally got some now. Um, We'll kind of figure it out from there. For once, I'm not overthinking everything. Cut grass. Ready for arts and crafts. Really? We're making arts and crafts out of our survival supplies now. Okay. I don't think that'd be my first choice for my survival supplies, but apparently it is. wander off here and get the sticks, and then we'll probably only have a minute or so of this, it looks like. It's moving pretty quick. Our sanity is going down. More flowers would be lovely. Uh, we'll wander around wherever we have to. 
when it comes to that point. Probably going to build some more storage at home. I'm not real sure. Maybe more drying rot racks. We're still going to have to do something to come up with more food, though. I don't know if we're better off making the farms or if we're better off trying to grow the berries and stuff at home. I'm not real sure. But we should still be having to deal with wolves or dogs here somewhat soon because we haven't seen any yet. And to me, that feels odd on day 10. Yeah, you're so hungry. Oh, shoot. Drop the rocks, take the flint. Uh, drop the niter, even though I know it does have some uses in the new DLC. I'm not sure if it has any in this one. I never found a use for it. If I can carry them, take them. I'm going to start trying to head towards home. Can't carry those. Flint, yes, definitely more tools. I didn't realize we were that low on flint. May have to try and do some rabbit traps here soon as well. Um, it's probably about the only way I'm going to come up with the deep. Oop, what's up here? The box thingy and the no. And I don't have. Oh, I didn't want to pick those anyway. Uh, what am I dropping? I gotta drop something. We got plenty of seeds at home, so let's drop some seeds. I guess we'll eat our berries out here. So I definitely get these two items home. Oh, and there's a spear. Yay. I ain't dropping my spear for that one. Mine's still 90%. Now, so tell me I can't carry the berries. I guess eat them. I'd rather turn them into decent food at home, since we really didn't come back with much food-wise. I guess we did. The mushrooms kind of count. Could always go fight the frogs and see if we can fish, too. We do have a fishing pole in our box at home. But we're going to have to clear out the frogs, I'm pretty sure, in order to be able to fish. Because it apparently doesn't work on this water on the edges of the map. But we do have frogs right around the corner from home, so... And let's hope we're actually heading home. Uh, maybe the long way home. Shoot. I think I gotta go all the way down here to get back to home. Oh well. Let's see if there's a connection or not. Got plenty of daylight left, so that's not really an issue. Got plenty of wood. As long as we get there, we should be okay. Yep, we have to run all the way around pretty much everything to get there. Alright, well, if nothing else, we're opening up the map so we can see where we're going and what we're doing from here on forward. Uh, I definitely want more of those. I don't know why I'm determined I'm going to run out of twigs, but I guess it's because I keep making so many tools. Could make the gold tools instead. I do have enough gold to do that, I guess. I don't know what items I need to be able to do that. And I am going to grab beefalo poo as much as I see it. That could equal more farms. More farms equals more food. Great, I can't carry the flowers, then drop them. Yeah, we're going to have to build some traps and come out this way. Trap some rabbits. I think that's going to be a pretty good priority to start getting this food stable. Uh, those do last during winter, whereas the farms and stuff help, but they don't grow nearly as fast once it's cold out. Can I have it, please? You don't want it. You just dropped it on the ground. It's mine now. There's enough for one more farm, which I think is what was eating up all of our stone, honestly. I think home is that way. No, home is back this way. Glad I decided to check that. So to home we hopefully go. As the pig gets eaten by the spider, and I'm tempted to go try and help, but nope, no thank you. Not right now. Alright. I can't harvest anything, and I can't... Well, the ashes can go. The 
monster meat's apparently not... Well, it says it's stale now. It is going to rot. It's just going to take frickin' forever. Um, come on, let's plant it. What are you eating? Are you eating my stuff? I am planting my forest off to this side away from the lightning rod. It is not nearly as important to me as my food crops are going to be, uh, as well as my twigs and stuff. So those are kind of going to circle the lightning rod. Um, lightning will hit and light everything on fire. Alright, you're hungry, you're hungry, you're hungry, fine. Uh, let's craft a board. Start the fire. And then let's go throw whatever we've randomly got left in the crock pot. Two blues, two greens equals possible food, possible death. Let's find out. Cook them. That's all I got right now. I did have a carrot and corn. I should have done that the other way around. But... Alright, now you give me more seeds. I know I put seeds in. Okay, I'm blind. I did. I'm just blind. Plant. Plant. Drop. Uh, the mushrooms just made ratatouille, really? That's it? Ugh. Well, that was, feels like it was a waste. Charcoal needs to go in the box for the fit. Pine cones come out and get planted. You can stack with that. Oh, I need to drop you and you in there. Yeah, we're gonna have to make another storage chest here shortly. And I do think another farm is gonna be needed pretty quickly as well. Um, I have the stuff on me to make that though, so that's fine. Uh, food. something or not? Frog coming. Oh, I actually have to fish. Shoot. I thought it was going to be an automated thing. I 
Froggy, you stay over there and just let me fish. I need food. And hopefully fish counts as helping your health some. Ow! Fucking frog. I didn't even see him come up. Oh, uh, well. Screw it. Pick up the spoiled monster meat. We're not going to use it to fertilize. Our plants aren't ready. Crockpot makes pretty much everything edible. Two monster meat, two fish equal a meal. Two extremely spoiled, almost actually rotten monster meat. What did that make? Monster lasagna. Eat. Don't kill me. Oh, it messed with my health. Great. I need health, which means I need to be picking flowers. Fuck. And not the evil ones. So I wonder if fish count as monster meat just like the monsters do, or... Going ski. I was supposed to be making rabbit traps today. That's part of the problem. And I don't think I've actually prototyped them yet. Okay, thank god. No, no, drop the rocks. Pick the rocks back up. Really? That trick used to work. I wonder if this will work. Come on, buddy. Need more grass. I might as well grab that while I'm waiting to see if he'll do what I want him to do. I don't know what I'm gonna bait any of the rest of these with. Nope. They've figured out a way around that old way of doing it. Come here, you punk. I'm getting hungry. More bunnies, more bunnies. There's one up there. This must be your hole. Hope that's your hole. I've got three rabbit. That should be a fairly decent meal, I would imagine. Aw. Yes, it'll be dark soon, but I'm running out of hunting time and I need frickin' food. Three of them, and a dairy. 
They don't know what this is gonna make, but it's food. Plant, plant, plant. I love how it sounds like he's eating them when he plants them. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Eat it. Well, that helped with that part. It didn't do much for the other, though. I still need to figure out how to start fertilizing this grass without using the beefalo stuff, but I guess I'm going to have to. Let's do the berry bushes first. Those are probably more important than the grass. Even though the grass would make more traps, then I can just start leaving them all over out there. And we are closer to beefalo food than anything else, so... No, not drop. Fertilize, darn it. So I can probably get this easier than I can even get the rabbits. Fertilize you to get you closer to done growing. Do you still have an eggplant? Eat. Cook the carrot. Eat. Which I should have probably kept the carrot to bait the rabbits with. That was brilliant. Didn't think about that one. Didn't think that one through very well. Hmm. Yeah, well. We're going to start focusing on rabbits now. Uh, apparently, that's the part I forgot to do this time around that I should have been doing. Another trap or two if I can. Alright, need more grass. But I have two traps now, so I can go back to the old method of just covering their holes with traps. And nearest rabbit holes. Do I go straight south or do I stay over there? I don't know. Oh, pick that up. We might need that map. Yeah, we gotta go this way. If we want to find rabbits, we can go this way. And I need to still continue gathering the grass because that's gonna help me get more rabbits. Beefalo are east, rabbits are south. Starting to gather more seeds because those are going to be more needed now. Oh, wake up, rabbits. It's morning. Get up. Get up, Ed. Fuzz needs food. sit overnight and come back for them. I think we can survive one night with the stuff we have at home. It would be nice to be digging all this up to replant it, but right now I'm more worried about the wasting the fertilizer on this than farms. I'd rather have ten farms than rabbit traps. Uh-oh, 
something's coming tonight. Not good. I'll be nice. I'll let it run long. We'll see what happens tonight. If we make it, we make it. If not, this will be the end of the series until I hear some feedback as to whether we should keep going or not. Because I think I'm walking away from home. I am. Ow! The gods are smiting me. They just struck me with lightning. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've got dogs coming in tonight. I think that's that sound. Alright guys, well that's going to be the end of this playthrough. We made it a whole 11 days. Woohoo! Uh, we may give it another shot. We'll have to play as somebody different if we do. Uh, but for now, have a good one guys. This is Fusion with Fusion ZX Gaming. Give us a sub and a like below if you enjoy the videos. Uh, let us know down in the comments what you'd like to see so we can see if we can get it set up for you. Have a good one.